Welcome to official SL TV channel. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and share my video and press the red button. Please help me to share my video. My CEO and national chairman of our Glorious All People's Congress political party. Honorable Minka Luman Segei, a very good morning, a very good afternoon, and a very good evening, sir. Detroit CL unions, both home and abroad, on a good morning, on a good afternoon, and on a good evening. Me, now my humble brother, Book and Pen, the poor man's friend, the Deputy Publicity Secretary, West West District of our Glorious All People's Congress Political Party. Of course, CL Unions today, now the sixteenth day, inside the month of October, twenty twenty-four. This day today, I very well aware, I very well know, and I very well understand, for CCL Unions, both home and abroad. No see this day today, last year, we been get the mediated dialogue between the APC and that of the SLPP field administration of Mother BO. We been make due to the mediated dialogue, we been get a joint agreement where at the end of the day they may come up with eight resolutions. We said that eight resolutions day. We all are CL unions who are very well aware and know say indeed this is not just the sad reality. For see, who say we all been get hope, trust, and confidence na being resolution 3D. We been tell we categorically clear. See the recommendations from the committees shall be actionable and implementable. We all Vuvuzela. All over the country, 24 hours, anybody where they give out in update, it go must make sure say resolution 3D of that particular signed agreement day for come at the media, low people them, they get confidence, low people and they get trust, low people and they know indeed for say that if we Mohammed Kana we connect tiff with elections, board the light and get to mother be where they can regain them back again. But this particular resolutions. We give power to the committee then. Because the committee then get autonomous power. We tell them, say, any recommendations we then come up with for be actionable and implementable. And we all see the recommendations from the committee. The 80 recommendations from the committee. We all lost here. We at the end of the day. We not get nothing day where we go celebrate. We no get not today. We go jubilate. We tell we anything about rerun. The only side who say we agree about rerun, now the APC self come and say, you know what? Both them people there, they not do well for the people of Sierra Leone. Mohamed Kone, both the like thief the elections and hand over to Madabio. We as APC, we go get we separate four point them where we go put for tell the international community say. In as much as the SFP do not agree for let me put them into that particular agreement the we they put them now we are separate you know document for telling see we as we know in as much as we not to Mohammed Kone for announce we say for say we win the elections we the put inside we on point for say we they get command a real one and that one day not just a separate agreement between the APC not to a binding document to that of the SLPP. And according to resolution 3D, it tell we categorically clear say the recommendations from the committee. Then are the APC and the SLP waiting to do agree upon now get for be actionable and implementable. So now I met today, we they continue for call on with people. Them. Let at least we get confidence now. We begin to get hope for let we come together and build up with party again. Waiting for give we hope. 
We for this other particular eighty recommendations day. When are the year on and not did they? So let we not continue for they get false hope from certain people and where they come for they give you false information, they give me some information, they give you this information. Let we stop. Now make yesterday. We see what in happen. But however, see Leonians. I got three important messages I really want to forget today. Based on all this particular synopsis I don't give on us so. Because at this particular moment, we need for the come out now and build confidence in the people for the future elections. Let me get confidence now for saying, you know what? Let me come together as CL unions. Let me come together as members of the APC. Let me come together as grassroots of the APC for all come and build up the party again. Let me let for the give false hope about the June 24th. 2023 general elections. This is not just the sad reality. It's painful, but this is just the sad reality. The June 24th, 2023 general elections, from the day one when Mohamed Kone brought the light, announced Madabu as the winner, and in the constitution of Sierra Leone, gave him the autonomous power and strength in the 1991 constitution. See, now in the only person we get the legitimate authority for announce who that win elections. It is for now, it not for now, it will go now, it not go now, it don't already announce mother view. And therefore, now I make a recall when I memories them back again. Say, we as a political party, we leader, when a Dr. Samura Matthews in Kama. During the time when Mohamed Konebi don't announce that sixty percent, now they for don't challenge that particular sixty percent day. By the end of the day, we leave that then when a Dr. Samoa say not to do or die. Now from there, Mohamed Kone don't bot ball. Now the APC they aid. the leader now for challenge. You the leader now you the lead. Then we the followers then we follow you and challenge the broad daylight robbery of Mohamed Kone. In announcement, but at the end of the day, we lead that then Dr. Samuel Matthews in Kamasi not to do or die. And at this particular moment, the 2024 2023 general elections, it don't go. So, this particular time around now, we all for come together, we all for come together and build up the party again for future elections. This is not just this a reality, and then reality there, we for the continue for the record in the minds of we people, them both home and abroad. More especially the grassroots of the APC. Because today, we all know, say, we get pain than we had. But this is just the sad reality. When allow we come and build up the APC again for future elections. Let we not allow waiting be not happen. We make we find ourselves in this particular situation today. Let it not repeat itself again. Now I make today say a union. I come with three important message. Now on a doorstep. For let we all they understand. Waiting at the nitty gritty. With what happened yesterday in the APC party office. One for me message here, the unions. A title I'm saying, Book and Pen. Thank the leadership of the All People's Congress political party for the proactive measures put in place yesterday, Tuesday, 15 October 2024, to protect the international community representatives. My second message here, the unions. A title I say, Book and Pen, gives special thanks to the CEO and national chairman of our glorious APC political party, Honorable Minkailu Mansaye, for the brilliant statement made to the international community representatives. My third message here, unions, a title I'm, I say, the poor man's friend, also thank the national publicity sector and deputy, Honorable C.D. Yaya Tunis, and comrade Mohammed Pope Kama for the adequate and accurate update given to the people of Sierra Leone and the grassroots of the All People's Congress political party. Indeed, Sierra Leoneans, we all see what will be happen. We all see what will be happen. What will be the goal at the social media on Monday when they see people and they call people and say, let we come along, go protest at the APC party office because we don't get with international moral guarantors them where they come at least for can't take power from Mother Bio and can't give to Dr. Samoa. 
with the Yagi again, people and they say, Lord, go storm the APC party office. This is not the wisdom of the leadership of the All People's Congress. They come together because then people are where they come, they need protection. And we don't want to see something like what may happen during the Women's Congress, the press conference. Now, make the leadership come together. Unanimously agreed. They say, you know what? Let me come out and tell the people of this country. Say that people are where they can, special representatives, where they can meet only the leadership of the All People's Congress, not a general meeting. But if this kind of message don't begin to go out on Monday, it worries some. And then people here, they need to be protected. And I make the party be come together and decide for pull out a press release for call on the presence of the security for only one reason, Sierra Leoneans. Let me know this. Let me know they misunderstand the leadership of the All People's Congress. Because so many people don't begin to misunderstand the leadership of the All People's Congress, say, then go call the police them back again for can kill them. Then go call the police them back again for can arrest them. Then go call the police them back again for can intimidate them. No. The leadership in the wisdom decide and say, you know what? Let we call the presence of the security. Then people are where they come. These people are special representatives from the international community. If anything can do them, this is the responsibility of the national officers of the party. And therefore, for let nothing not happen, let me not see again a replica of what may happen on the Women's Congress and Press Conference. Who saw we see people them, they challenge themselves. Who saw we see people them, they fight each other. We know what again for letting people and they come again. We can see again people them within the SLPP can't take the advantage. They can't begin to send stone, can't begin to send something them at the end of the day. They can't see the APC like a bad political party. I don't want for let the general membership or the grassroots of the, the All People's Congress for take them different way. No, the people are where they can, they need protection. And the protection would have forgiven them, not the APC, because now the APC party office, then they come. So do you have Sierra Leoneans? Do you have the grassroots of the APC? Let me not misunderstand the leadership for say they don't go call police presence. We've been beat with people yesterday, where they do extrajudicial killing against with people yesterday, where they torture with people, where they intimidate with people, they don't go call them back for can beat, for can wound, for can. No, this is wrong. This is wrong. This is just the sad reality. The leadership come together in the wisdom and say, you know what? What you know they happen at the media so when the people and don't begin the call, say let everybody come on a do. They, they call all the voters and come on a do for go protect the vote. Able like seriously. Like seriously. Now then people are where they can and they can go back with vote. Then people are where they can and not go but change nothing again inside of 80 recommendations. Then people are not going to come again for can't change. Nothing again waiting on day before them. And therefore they come exactly for can get with the leadership for let them can know exactly what in the go on. We make today, I really want to commend the leadership of the All People's Congress for not proactive measures on put in place for protect the international community representatives them yesterday. I really dock me out and salute now. Because if not to be that, with the kind way and manner, our messages them be the common and the media they pump up. I believe say something bad for don't happen. And I also want to thank the Deputy National Publicity Secretary. Welcome now the media and come make it, this thing so clear. It come in a very, very timely and it makes sure say it do a message accurately and adequately for at least the listeners, more especially the one that were misinform or disinform the people of Sierra Leone with regards to the coming of the international community representative to the APC. I want to thank you so much, our Deputy National Publicity Secretary, Comrade Mohammed Pope Kamar. I dock me out and salute you, my boss. God bless you for such a wonderful, you know, message where you give before the day yesterday. I want to commend you and appreciate, appreciate you so, so much. Now, Sierra Leoneans, we all don't see exactly what happened yesterday. And what happened yesterday, I know say so many of we don't see the video where they circulate right now on the social media with regards to the statement of the CEO and national chairman of our glorious All People's Congress political party. We make me, book and pen, the poor man's friend, I come this day today for give him a special thanks because of that brilliant statement we make 
to the international community representative yesterday. You know, Sierra Leoneans, when you get a seasoned politician, when you get somebody we really lack in political party, when you see somebody we really believe for saying, indeed, what in the go on within a political party, in need for address them. We all see the video where I believe, say, me again, book and pen. I will come again and share them with this message for let we listen them because certain people them just they see video then just they pass them then just they pass them but me they draw on attention civil unions both home and abroad and they draw on attention civil unions both home and abroad and they draw on attention the grassroots of the all people's congress for let una at least listen that video day where they see you a national Chairman of our glorious All People's Congress political party, the Honorable Mikhail Mansari, make yesterday before the international community, so that we all will get confidence, so that we all could come together and build up the APC again for future elections. This is just a sad reality. All we will they try for do now, not for we put we hands together for future elections. This not to for Canada the media, for can disrespect authorities. This not for Canada the media, for can use abusive language against authorities. This not the time we want for come together for build up the APC party again. So that that mistake we don't do. Way back in 2018, 2019, 2020, take on to 2021, 2022, where we get so many bad, bad things that will happen within that particular time then day when certain set of people take the party to court. We don't want to gain a replica of such incident again for happen within the All People's Congress. Now make with they come and ensure say we come and say the truth to we people them. For let them get this kind of confidence for say let we come now and build up the party for future elections. Let we stop the abusive language. Let we stop the attack against authorities. You know they help this party in progress one. At this particular moment, come us all. I really want for long to join me, book and pen the poor man's friend for frankly see your national chairman of our glorious All People's Congress party. The Honorable Mikhail Mansari for such a brilliant statement we make yesterday to the international community. Una don't hear it? He draw the, the highlight of the mediated dialogue na been to money. On October 18, when they be signed, he talk about the 80 resolutions. The progress, what they don't make. The challenges, what they don't make. And waiting again, the international community, they need for no, based on some of the challenges they wouldn't get. And he also made mention of the tripartite recommendations. But at the end of it, all CL unions, I don't want to say exactly, I don't want to borrow words from the CEO and national chairman of our glorious All People's Congress political party. When I go listen to them for myself again, not the video, because I don't want to borrow words from the CEO and national chairman of our glorious All People's Congress. CL unions, general membership of the All People's Congress, the grassroots of the APC, do ya when we come together and build up a party again for future elections the june 24th 2023 general elections we on that day yesterday we papa yesterday we leader yesterday when a dr samua matthew wilson kama during the announcement of that manipulated cook 60 percent when muhammad Kone announced now therefore don't show leadership for let like, tell we in followers then say you know what Muhammad Kone, this is not the last you can ever do in your life and they challenge you from now take or die now that did the doctor Samoa for don't challenge but he allowed Muhammad Kone for go away and go take again another halaki manipulated 40 percent and go add them to that 60 crooked and manipulated percent and announce finally mother be you as the winner and announce Mother Bio finally as the winner. And Mohamed Kone, the 1991 constitution, gave autonomous power, where she writes that the constitution for saying that he's not the only person we get the authority, we get the legitimate authority for announce Udana not the winner of the elections. And he don't announce them. He don't announce them. So all what we do now as APC, now for let we put we house together for future elections. This is just the sad reality. Unale we left the mamikos. Unale we left the disrespect. Unale we left all the attack against authorities. Unale we left the misinformation. Unale we left the disinformation. Thank enough to 
the deputy national publicity secretary comrade Mohamed Pope Kama we come on Monday and can tell we exactly the purpose of them people here in Kama and he tell we all for say not to rally we get he tell we for say at least we know they come for camp protest he make a known to the public and he make a known to the government let tomorrow not say the APC the protest for waiting what will they protest for they talk for protest for we right with daddy yesterday with papa yesterday we leader yesterday when a doctor Samoa say not to do or die. Why we again at this particular time around where they can't call people again for waiting? For go give them more burden, for go give them more contact. We know what again search for happen. Let me begin to tell you people in the reality. I believe say waiting happened yesterday. We all lost him. We all now for come together now and put we us together for future elections. At this particular moment, I want to thank the CEO. A national chairman of our glorious all people's congress political party for such a brilliant statement yesterday where you make before the international community i salute you my ceo and national chairman honorable alaji you deserve the chairmanship you deserve answer now now see unions now now the grassroots of the all people's congress don't know saying indeed 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 you are seasoned politician and you like the apc so so much and now what do you want now a brighter future for the All People's Congress. And the promise where you don't make yesterday, believe you me, my CEO and National Chairman of our glorious All People's Congress political party, we believe in you and we believe, say, you could discharge your responsibility and ensure, say, the APC will form the next government again in any future elections. At this particular moment, say, early unions, I want to say much love to you, our CEO and National Chairman. Once again, say, early unions, my last message as I say, the poor man's friend, they continue for thank the national publicity sector and deputy. CD, Honorable CD Tunis, and Comrade Mohammed Pope Kama for the adequate and accurate update given to the people of Sierra Leone and the grassroots of the APC. Of course, Sierra Leoneans, we see the adequate and accurate message way. The national publicity sector gave yesterday. Can you imagine? This is not a business as usual. They don't say yes, they don't see say indeed, where they get a lot of misinformation at the media. They don't see say yes, where they get a lot of disinformation at the media. Now they don't come together and know, you know what? Let me correct what we don't go wrong. Now anything where they happen, we they ensure say we get accurate and adequate message to people in this country so that they no go get misinformation or disinformation with regards to any engagement ever again within the all people's congress i want to thank you my boss the national publicity sector of our glorious all people's congress political party we come yesterday and can outline the outcome of the meeting i believe so we all don't see the audio in circulations and not come again for both words from me boss the national publicity sector Honorable CD here at Tunis. Yes, yesterday. This man be don't come yesterday. He don't come for say the truth. But at the end of it all, now mommy calls disrespect, abusive language, attack, counter-attack by this particular gentleman. The deputy publicity sector again gonna vine memorial again. During the time where former honorable Sosoya be come and do gesture to the Western region representatives. At the end of it all, he say again, let me come and sell with people in the reality. The June 24, 2023 general elections, no get on inside the recommendations from the committee. They come again and use a lot of abusive language against them, attacking personality, use all kind of abusive language against them. Today, we all don't see what in the happen. We know the stop for come out and tell people them say, the June 24th, 2023 general elections, Sierra Leoneans, we leader yesterday, we daddy yesterday, we papa yesterday, Dr. Samuel Matthew is in Kama. Don't tell we say not to do or die. Now I make Mohammed Connect get mine for announce Mohammed and eh, eh, Mother Bio. Because if yesterday, we daddy yesterday, we papa yesterday, we leader yesterday, Dr. Samoa, we don't lend that 60%. We're not for those who are so elected, no so. So the truth is bitter for Swella. 
But now this is not the only solution now. We will bring back the lost glory of the All People's Congress political party together. So at this particular moment, CL unions, we all lawyer reform we boss, the national publicity sector of the great All People's Congress, the Honorable CDI at Tunis. You don't can tell you exactly what happened yesterday with the Gasto, the international community representative, they wouldn't come. Waiting, waiting, then tell them we all hear you again. We at least in the tech again, waiting the CEO and national chairman of our glorious all people's congress political party be tell the international community yesterday. As I say, I don't want for borrow words again from a national publicity sector of our glorious all people's congress political party. The honorable CDI at I believe say the audio day in circulation for you will not listen to audio day yet, please. Go now and search for that audio do. Let you listen what another message we come out yesterday from that particular meeting day between the international community representatives and that of the leadership of the All People's Congress political party. At this particular moment, Sierra unions, all I can say at this particular moment, now for let we all come together and build up a party again for future elections. Let we come together and support the CEO and national chairman of our glorious All People's Congress political party, the Honorable Alaji Min Kailu Mansari, for let we get a brighter future APC again. For let we see we political party again in future elections, gain governance. I believe that this now we own responsibility now. We all know, see, let we left now the misinformation of the media. Let we left now the disinformation of the media. Let we come and see the reality. It's better too late than never. For we, we don't misinform people in yesterday. I believe say, this is not the time now for let we turn a new page for come begin telling the reality. For we yesterday, where they continue for telling people in the reality, let we not stop. Let we continue for telling people in the reality for say indeed the June 24th, 2023 general elections. Of course, we daddy yesterday. We own papa yesterday. The leader yesterday, we all be done go to McKinney and go sacrifice for. We risk we life them. We send no what? Not Dr. Samuel we want. The leadership all come together. Some people have sacrificed their position. Some people have sacrificed their integrity. Some people have inside the parliament. They sacrifice and call all many members of parliament. They sacrifice and declare for one gun Dr. Samuel Matthew is in Kama. At the end of the day, we go to McKinney, we see the result. He come up with a landslide victory with over 1,000 and some hundreds for tell the whole world for say, indeed, the leadership and the electorate don't come together and give them because we believe, say, it will manage this country economy for we in a better way. We we all are serial unions, we left them go better. But Allah, now they give power. Allah not been destined for the power. Now I make a look, Muhammad, can we connect? Now yeah. After that 60% announced, can you imagine Sierra Leoneans? The district headquarters towns them. The Tale Center there. Then they pa make sure say they collect the 60% we don't come inside first. Then they pa that collection day. Mama Kone announced the 60%. We raise serious concern. We make the representative there at the district headquarters towns there at the Tale Center. Then say, Bo, we they pa tell the, the, the result. Then you don't go announce 60%. I believe it's another 10 in day. We daddy yesterday. We papa yesterday, we leader yesterday, and we flag bearer and presidential candidate of the All People's Congress yesterday when a Dr. Samoa Matthew is in Kama. For don't challenge, if I don't call we the supporter then for say, you know what? Let me come out, let me show the world for say, why make don't see the will of the people? But he said not to do or die. So do you see your unions? Now let me come together. Now let me come together and support the CEO and national chairman of our glorious All People's Congress for let we build up the party again for future elections. Once again, CL unions, me and our humble brother Book and Pen, the poor man's friend, the deputy publicity secretary of our glorious All People's Congress political party within the West West District. They say Tata and God bless we all. Let me not forget CL unions. Today, the National Young Congress, they, they organize peace, unity, and tour, reconciliation within the western region and the call on we all at this particular moment for let we go to the party office now by 11 11 30 for let we go witness this all important occasions again of the young congress representatives cut across the country at this particular moment i want for say tata and god bless we all